Hey Pisces, I hope you guys are doing well. So Pisces, this is going to be a low reading for Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Also check your Jupiter, your North Node, what signs in your 7th house, alright? It won't resonate with every single Pisces energy that watches, alright? Um, take what resonates and leave the rest, or take it how it resonates to your life, okay? Um, personal readings in the description box, you guys. And, um, yeah, hit that like, hit that subscribe, y'all. Codependency pops out. Flirt. Make the effort. And very soon, Pisces. Let's see what's going on, what's going on. Okay, so Cancer also got codependency, all right? Uh, so some of you guys might be dealing with a cancer or you have cancer in your chart somewhere. Um, let's see what comes out though. Codependency. Ooh. The eight of swords. Yeah. Somebody is codependent. Pisces. Could be you. Could be someone in your energy. Five of swords on the bottom of the deck. Mm-hmm. Yep. Why is this flirt here? Ooh, the Queen of Pentacles. Could be a Capricorn for some of you. Page of Cups on the bottom. Ooh. Hmm. Some of you guys might have a love offer coming in from somebody. Pisces. Um, I'm seeing a lot of people are seeing you in this energy. Uh Pisces, this Queen of Pentacles. No matter what your financial situation is, I'm, see, I'm seeing that this is how you're coming off to people. Uh, the Strength card and the Page of Wands. Oh, some of y'all about to get a text from somebody. Y'all about to hear from, oh, y'all, the Page of Wands is on the bottom of this deck, too. Some of y'all are about to hear from someone. Y'all about to get a text message from somebody. Page of Cups again on the bottom. Yep, could be an apology um, for some of you. So, somebody is really, really trapped in their head of uh, Pisces about um, talking to you. And I'm also getting someone is, uh, yeah, King of Pentacles on the bottom. This could be a divine counterpart of some sort, uh, Pisces, for you. Um, I'm feeling like somebody might be trapped by their addictions. And the train confirms. Someone might be uh, a slave to their addictions. Why is this eight of swords here? The moon. Yep. They're a slave to their addictions, Pisces. And you might not even know about um, these addictions that they have. Okay. Um... It could be a number of things, too. Um, they could also be addicted to you, Pisces. Take that how it resonates. This person, regardless if they're talking to you or not, because I feel like this person is, like, kind of stuck, or they have been stuck. They're about to come out of that, though. Uh, whatever whatever stuck energy they're in, um, they're about to come out of it, okay? Okay. So, the Ten of Swords is on the bottom. So, this is definitely a situation that has ended at one point. So, we have the King of Swords came out. Yeah. The Nine of Pentacles. The Hermit. Ooh. And I told y'all the Ace of Cups. Yeah. I told y'all somebody is about to come and give you a... Uh, you're about to get a message of some sort from somebody. Um, and it could be... A love offer of some sort um, like I said if, like I said earlier with this page of cups on the bottom it could be an apology for some of you uh, I feel like a lot of you though are when it comes to dating you are kind of taking a more logical approach um, than you usually do with this king of swords here um, you may also be kind of talking to someone that is in this this, this is this king of swords energy and usually the king of swords is like a professional man um this is like like a stockbroker or a uh an attorney um a banker or something along the lines of that uh guys 
some of you guys might be kind of you know chopping it up with somebody that's that's a professional man take it how it resonates pisces it won't resonate with everybody okay um yeah, I, I feel like whoever this person is in your energy, Pisces, is hiding addictions. They've been hiding some type of addiction, okay? And like I said, it could be an addiction to you. Could be to, you know, drugs, alcohol, sex. It could be pretty much anything. Um, And I feel like whatever addiction this is, you guys, they're, they're hiding it from, if this isn't you, Pisces, I feel like whatever addiction this is, the Nine of Cups on the bottom, so it could be a drinking problem for some of you. Um, this person is hiding it, and not just from you, but from everybody. I feel like nobody in this person's life, whoever this person is, is in your energy, nobody in this person's life knows about this addiction. They've been hiding it. And I also feel like this addiction has, has kind of kept them from uh, talking to you. Yeah, it could be a fire sign for some of you, particularly a Leo. Eight of Cups on the bottom. You're emotionally detaching from this person, Pisces, or you've emotionally detached. Some of you guys might be intuitively, intuitively aware of their addiction. Yeah. Could be a fire sign with this addiction, guys. Some of y'all are dealing with a fire sign. So all these cards flipped over. I'm not going to take all these. But the Nine of Cups sh shows up again. So a lot, for a lot of you, it's a drinking problem for some of you That that is that they're hiding. Um, the drinking, too, you guys, the hangman's under it. I'm going to show you guys all the cards. Yeah, the Star, the Ace of Swords, the King of Pentacles, the Judgment. What's under the hangman? The Ten of Wands. Yeah. So, I'm not taking all these, but damn it, y'all saw that, right? <laughs> Spare said, yes, you are. <laughs> okay, all right, I'll take these, all right? So, it's a drinking problem, all right, like I've been saying. Um, with the hangman under it, this is y'all's energy, this is Pisces energy, but Pisces, I feel like they have been drinking to keep from reaching out to you. They they're using the alcohol as as a as a vice. Hold on, y'all. Let me take a sip of water. <clears throat> they're using the alcohol as a vice to not reach out to you, Pisces. Okay. So, um, yeah. This is also, you guys, with it's also crossing the king of uh, the, the queen of pentacles. So I'm seeing that you are really um you're really comfortable right now. Two different energy. This this nine of cups means two different things for you and for your person. This nine of cups for your person, I feel like is them pretty much trying to drown their sorrow away with whatever they can, with whatever vices that they can. The the nine of cups for you. Pisces, I feel like it's you're just like really comfortable right now. You're good. You're happy. You're enjoying life. I feel like some of you guys are entertaining someone else. Y'all might not be together or whatever, but I feel like y'all are kind of chopping it up with somebody else. Um, I feel like you're good, Pisces. Um, I'm not getting that you're you're like in any type of like fucked up energy now. This person, on the other hand, that's see, yeah, the devil. What I tell y'all. This person, on the other hand, and the sun. Yeah, y'all about to hear from this person. Y'all about to hear from this person. This person has some obsessive ten tendencies. This person is obsessing over you. Obsessing over reaching out. Obsessing over the fact that you're not reaching out to them. Obsessing over how to talk to you. This person wants to reach out to you so bad, guys. So bad. And they see you as happiness. We have the Nine of Cups and the Sun here on the same row. This person sees you as their happiness. Now, they may they probably didn't show that to you before. This person has some inner work they need to do with this Strength card. Um, and this Nine of Pentacles, I feel like it could be financial that they need to work on. Um, or they're, they're using the finances as a way to um, cloud the inner work that needs to be done. This person has some inner work that needs to be done, okay? 
that's the same with this moon the, the same energy i'm getting with this moon yeah eight of pentacles on the bottom yeah this person needs to work on themselves a little bit okay um because they they have some some behaviors that are getting in the way of their connections and i feel like it's not just the connection between you and them pisces but their connections in their life also though with you pisces this person has some um obsessive tendencies they're going to reach out though they're going to cave in and reach out this person may also be in hermit mode um trying to figure out how to um come forward but yeah this person drinks pisces to to get their mind off of you it's not working this person may also be drunk when they reach out so just be mindful of that um they may be under the influence when they reach out to you um and they will uh this person's going to reach out to you and i feel like for some of you you may you may deal with them again and for some of you you won't okay uh I'm not here to tell nobody what to do, okay? Let's get some handwritten love messages. Okay, something fell out. Whole Town Laughing by Jagged Edge. Mm, that's fitting. Tragic by Jasmine Sullivan, yes. This song pretty much talks about, if you know, this song pretty much talks about um, somebody basically not putting in any effort. And I feel like this person wasn't putting in any effort. Uh, when you were dealing with them so you ended it or they ended it regardless of who ended it um pisces this person is obsessing over reaching out to you they can't stand not hearing from you uh pisces mm, yeah i didn't know what i had till i lost it yep these are the same um I think Scorpio got these as well. I'm working on myself for you, yeah. Your lips look so kissable. Yeah, Scorpio got these same uh, cards. I'm obsessed with you. Didn't I tell you, Pisces? This person is obsessed. I thought I would never lose you. Mm-hmm. And you see, now look at you. I'm not going anywhere. <laughs> Pisces, Pisces, Pisces. Best part by her. I want to see you right now. Yeah, Scorpio got a lot of these same cards, guys. I love you more than I showed you. Mm hmm. Communication through music. Okay, then. And, um,. I know my pride and ego can be too much at times. Yeah, you guys, that's what I meant to say earlier too. With When the devil came out with the sun, this is an ego problem. This person has a massive ego problem, guys. That could be a reason why they haven't been reaching out as well. Um, that could also be a reason why you pulled your energy away from this person altogether. My money is funny right now. See, I did say that this person might be having some type of money issue as well um, with this Nine of Pentacles here in the in the Strength card. I feel like they want to have something to offer you, but they're coming up as a page, guys. Okay, this person comes up as a page. So I'm not really getting the vibe that they really have a lot to offer right now. And I'm not saying that that's, it'll be like that forever, okay? But right now, um, you know, they have to get over this addiction whatever this addiction is it's going to be different for you all of you pisces you know you know better than i do all right so pisces if this resonated hit that like hit that subscribe guys and i appreciate you guys so much for watching peace out